Why hello there, people! Today I will be criticizing a infamous artist in the art community that goes by the name Luna. At the time of recording this, goes by the name Luna, of course, and they use they them pronouns. I have to specify that since uh, every time they get called out for something, they change their name to avoid recognition. They also own multiple accounts on multiple platforms, so I will list a list of usernames they have, so things won't be as confusing. OC theft and tracing. Okay, so I wanted to start off from the least offensive thing Luna has done. Uh, I will be I will be starting from the OC theft since it does not need a trigger warning. As we go along, I'll need to give some trigger warnings due to the heavy content. So they have stolen characters and adoptables, as far as I know, from two people. Uh, the two people being involved are Kenji and Milky. I know that those people have have uh, not don't have the best past, but it doesn't make it right to steal characters from them. So Milky posted their bunny bloody thing OC on December 29th, 2019, and Luna posted their drawing a couple of weeks ago. I don't remember the exact date, but here are the drawings. Here you can see Milky's one being uploaded in fucking 2019, and here you can see um, Luna's one being uploaded a couple of days ago, but I don't have the exact time frame of it. I have to say that uh, the, they changed this, the Blood Puppy account uh, to another name that will be mentioned later in the video. So why does Luna write in the description? Milky might harass me to death, but I'll risk it, I guess. She might harass me to hell and back. Well, Luna used some of Milky's old art as her profile picture without uh, her consent. Milky, understandably, did not fucking like that. And Milky told Luna to stop doing it. Here are some of the screenshots of uh, Luna using Milky's old art as their profile picture, so yeah. Also, I will link uh, Milky's callout post in the description, along with every single one of my sources. Okay, so let's get into the tracing. So, I just got uh, some screenshots of Luna Tracing. I don't have much to say since I find it honestly so hypocritical how Luna, in every single of one of their accounts, in their bio, says to not trace or copy their art while they are literally tracing Mil Milky's art. Like, it's, it's just so dumb. It, that's not even a critique at this point, that's even just a fact. But I have to say that we have way harsher um, things to criticize in this post. Well, it's not a post, it's a video. Anyway, I will just show some more instances of them tracing Milky. I don't have really much to say except that you're childish. Like, if you're like gonna trace, just why? I'm just wondering. So. Well, I want to add that tracing is not the solution to improve your anatomy skills. Luna should have studied anatomy references instead of tracing other artists like Milky. The artist in this case is Milky, so sorry for repeating myself. Like, Luna, listen, here's a friendly tip. You may have... you literally have tutorials on Google that will actually help. I hope you consider that. I don't wish any harm upon you. Just... Just, I don't. I never wish harm upon anyone. I just want you to know that what you're doing is wrong. Especially in uh, what we will discuss now. Trigger warning for sensitive topics. As you saw in the thumbnail, there was some death art. So, warning to the... The following content might be considered disturbing for some audiences. The following segment will feature Discord hate groups against Milky and other disgusting things like death art. Before we continue, you have the chance to click off the video. And I'll say, Luna, why? Why it's childish? So here's the warning. Click off the video if you are disturbed. So, recently I was informed about a server that was created by Luna. The server was made to target Milky and basically cyberbully her. 
Some members have shared some screenshots with me, so I'll share them in this video. So um, let me like give some context. <clears throat> so um, let me give some context very quickly. So Milky Kiwi used to be an account on Instagram that was allegedly conf that, that was alleged to be Luna. I apologize for the screenshot being low quality, but since the account from uh, but since I know the account doesn't exist anymore, I had to go through highlights of report accounts to get the screenshot. I personally think that it might have been Luna since there is a specific Discord conversation that uh, happened in the Milky server that uh, involves this person named Nezibean and Luna. So Nezibean says, OMG, yes, show. Cute emoji. Yeah, hang on. Luna said. Luna sent this, the same picture that the Milky Kiwi account had uploaded. Luna said, And I made it look like she stole it. Nezibean says, You made it to look so much better though. Luna said, Thanks, even though it took literally the rest of my night and speed the whole album to finish. So that pretty much leads many call-out accounts to, to believe that uh, that was Luna. So I'll leave that up to speculation, but that was just some evidence that I wanted to share. Uh, so the individual that provided some of the screenshots for this video is Ink Jamie Plays YT on Instagram. I will link them in my sources in the in the description and the pinned comment. But I will have to say that they won't update on the situation due to mental health reasons. Also, final warning: if anyone is sensitive to death, please click off the video. That was just a small warning warning for you. Recently, Luna made some very disgusting art depicting Milky either killing herself or being beheaded by Luna's OC. I hope Luna will improve their behavior after this critique, since it's honestly disgusting to see someone in the art community behaving like this. So the cat thing with like the blonde hair that's like literally leaking blood out of their eyes is supposed to be Milky. So GG on that one. <laughs> also, there is another drawing that I mentioned um that's pretty much like milky hanging and um luna's oc just chilling there with the phone just kind of like being like yay so i have to say this is not extremely disgusting but extremely fucking childish you might not be a fan of milky but you do not have the right to make death art of milky like literally i thought that was common sense but i guess it's not you really have to be out of touch with reality to think that it's uh, okay to make death art of someone's self of Sona. Milky has said multiple times that the character depicted in those drawings is supposed to be them. Kind of like an, an idealized version of them, so yeah. Also, Milky took that as a personal threat. So here's Milky's uh, story on Instagram from their report account. It says, I said also multiple times that publicly that this specific Sona is meant to be me, like literally me. IRL. She's a representation of me. I don't know how to explain it, so I'll be taking these as a personal threat. Skull emoji. At this point, like, what Luna has done is like a huge L to the art community. Like, there have been like so many threads about them on Twitter and so many posts on Instagram that just make me like want to go, does this 15 year old, almost 16 year old kid understand that what they are doing is wrong? Well, I don't think that they are, so. Anyway, I don't have uh, m much more to say about the death art thing, except that Luna should stop drawing those kinds of things since it's bad. So yeah, signing out.